welcome to the Brooklyn Brothers. Man, Check look out. at those auto hearts. <laughs> they look good. Oh man, this is a great appetizer right here. Today, Chef Dom's going to show you our grandmother's recipe for these baked artichoke hearts. Been in the family for a long time. All right. Every holiday we've had them. Oh yeah. All right, let's get cooking. Let's eat. <laughs> okay, we're going to put together our artichoke hearts, uh, Italian artichoke hearts. Uh, we have uh, artichokes, whole baby artichokes. Uh, uh, Pecorino Romano cheese, Italian parsley, uh, breadcrumbs, garlic, and we're gonna get started. I'm gonna chop up some garlic. All right, we got our garlic cut. Chop up some uh, parsley. Some olive oil in here, extra virgin olive oil. You want to use a little extra so the breadcrumb, when the oil coats the breadcrumb, it'll be it'll toast really nice in the oven. Sounds good. All right, we're gonna uh, fry up a little garlic here. You don't want to get it too dark, light golden brown. We're gonna put our artichoke hearts or artichokes in here. Spread them out like that. Perfect. All right, our garlic is almost uh, toasted up. Oh man, that smell of garlic. Uh, Nothing like it, not at all. All right, let's go ahead and come over here. I'm gonna uh, just spread this out. Oh yeah. I may add a little more olive oil to it. See how the red crumbs are. Okay. All right, we're gonna Add some pepper to this. Now we're gonna put just a little bit of salt on here. Because you know, you got the breadcrumbs are a little salty. Uh, the Pecorino Romano cheese. All right. Now we're gonna just go ahead and uh, I like extra breadcrumb on mine because they come nice and crispy on top. Yeah. I like a lot of breadcrumb too. Oh, beautiful. All right. Okay. All right, now we're gonna add our uh, Parsley. Well, this is an easy dish. It is very simple. Uh, this was a Romano cheese. Beautiful. This was a uh, a uh, family side dish during Thanksgiving. The only time I, my grandmother or mother made this was on Thanksgiving. We'd oh. fight over them too. <laughs> <laughs> this is a treat. Oh. All right, I'm gonna add a little more olive oil to the top of the breadcrumbs and cheese. Yeah. That's it. They're ready for the oven. All right, let's get them in there. I'm hungry. 
You're always hungry. <laughs> yeah, put it in there. It's, it's ready. The oven's oh, ready. Oh, the oven's ready? Yeah. Fine. Look at that beautiful. Oh, let me see that. Let me see that one more time. Oh, yeah. Nice. Yeah, you probably want to let them cook for about maybe 30, 35 minutes. Oh, nice. When they're nice and toasted on the top, the breadcrumb, they're ready. All right. I'm ready. All right, we're gonna take our artichoke hearts out and they look like they are ready. Oh yeah. Nice and brown on oh, the top. Wow. Even some of the garlic got a little more, you know, got toasted a little more. Oh, beautiful. And we are ready to eat. Let's eat. Check out these oh. artichokes. <laughs> They're oh, looking they, good. They look really good. Hey, by the way, you know, we're scratching the surface right now for that thousand subscriber. Um, it really is not too bad. We've only done it for a little more than almost seven months now. So uh, we're just about there. Anyway, we appreciate everyone who did subscribe and anyone who Thank would. you. Thank you. Yeah. All right, man. Let's check these out. Are you making a sandwich or, or just cut up the bread? I don't know. I have enough bread. What do you mean you have enough bread? <laughs> <laughs> would you eat all one? No. <laughs> hey, that pasta. Oh my god. Let's test these out. Mm. Very, very good. Why is this a Thanksgiving dinner at home? Oh man. Oh, we got nothing. These are really good. Anyway, thanks for watching. Again, we appreciate the subscribers, and we'll see you next time. Thanks again. Take care.